Looky, looky here. Lately, we... Uh, I don't even know whether you call it luck or bad luck or what, but we've had a bit of a roller coaster of a ride. We tamed up an Apex Giga the other day and it immediately died, but we are still on the hunt, on the lookout for a stronger tame, which leads me to this little guy down here, a level 500 Alpha Rex. It's a step back from the Apexes that we've been focusing on lately, but... The thing has a truckload of health, it has a truckload of torpor, and overall, I'm just interested in... Like, I think we might need to go back, basically. I think we might have got a little bit ahead of ourselves shooting for apexes when uh, maybe all along, all we've needed is a really strong alpha. A very high level alpha at that. I could be wrong. I could be going about this the complete wrong way. And in fact, I'm a little bit nervous about being out here right now because I know that there is a demonic wyvern in the area, but I don't know. I just think we got to make this happen. The only thing is something big stands between us and being able to do this, and that is dealing a lot of torpor. So hopefully today we can work that out. We can get this Rex and we can see if it satisfies everything we're looking for. For now though, let us return home, which when I left was a very safe location. There's no guarantee that it's ever going to be safe when we return. We need to stay on our toes. We just never know what's going to be going on here. There's explosions and bosses and all sorts spawning all over the place at all times. But right this second, it's looking pretty darn good. Uh, first things, wow, that's a lot of meat. I don't necessarily need to be carrying that much meat, but lovely. I don't necessarily need to be carrying that much meat, but lovely. But that leads me to, uh, I guess, what we gotta focus on to get our hands on some better tranks and stuff. Uh, and that comes down to, hopefully, this work. Oh, it does work today. There we go. Oh my goodness. Yes, they were having trouble learning this stuff. It looks like now we're A-OK. -okay. Can we please? Oh, get out of town. Really? Oh, don't tell me. Don't do this to me again. We had this issue yesterday. And I couldn't learn... I couldn't... I couldn't learn blueprints. What are you doing to me, game? What are you doing to me? Why? Can I just learn some random... So I can learn just random stuff. What are these things? Can't learn those. But I can't learn a long neck rifle of all things. I refuse to believe that that is the case. This is the most bizarre thing ever. I can learn anything else. Just not the guns. But why? Why do you do this to me, game? I don't, I don't, I really don't understand it. Unless. No, nah, they're definitely not learnt. I definitely can't craft it. Ugh. You know what? When uh, the game plays up, it's time to do so well it's not even cheesy business when you think about it but i'm crafting up the augment station if i am not able to get my hands on darts which is what i had intended to do then i instead i'm just going to get an extra powerful crossbow it's simple as that that's all we can do so i need to increase the damage of this thing i need this thing to be as powerful as we can possibly get it so i'm gonna make this thing as powerful, powerful as I can possibly get it. I'm probably going to be missing charcoal, right? Uh, or metal ingots. Metal ingots? Metal? Fiber? Actually, what are we missing if I just want like 10 of these things right here? Charcoal! Oh, snap. Okay, that's going to take me a little bit of time to collect. Uh, but anyways, I can apply... Wow, okay, there we go. We just nearly doubled this thing already. Double junk chocolate cookie. Let's go! <laughs> I need 120 charcoal. That's all I need if I want to, like, pump this thing up a bunch. Uh, I could make that work. All I would need to do... Sorry, my dinosaurs got all out of whack because I tried to do a little bit of uh, end my own life to see if that would fix our problem. Unfortunately, no, it did not. Uh, I'm going to head over to the old volcanic region, see if I can find some charcoal out there, and, uh, I don't know, basically see if these trees hook us up with a bunch of the stuff without crashing. I'll save the game. <laughs> uh, I've crashed a few times over here recently, so fingers crossed that doesn't happen. Also, what are we looking at? We got we got a chunky, chunky Kano, little baby Rex, uh, an RG. Yeah, that's all fine. Are these technically charred trees or are these just regular trees? No. Didn't think so. They look pretty regular. They don't, they don't look like burnt up trees. Uh, I'm still going to fly through here as long as the game allows me to do it. 
Yeah, but none of these are going to give me charcoal. I can already tell. They just don't look like charred trees. So, oh, snap. That's going to explode, ain't it? There's a bionic up here and he angry. Yeah, we're not safe. I'm getting out of here. <laughs> yep. Uh, nice try. But yeah. Oh, red. Red drop. Red drop. I haven't, I, haven't, I haven't opened up a red drop yet. Look at all the yellow ones popping up around us too. Uh, hey, look. The only other way around this that I can see is that we accidentally pop open one of these supply drops that has a long neck rifle in it. At least I can, until I can work out how to fix this bug that for some reason will not allow me what I need to do. Um, anyways, this supply drop, I can already see what's inside of it. Uh, dude, not terrible. Compound bow, I'll take it. Not bad at all. Also, you can break down this for some resources. Uh, among the other stuff. It's not too bad. Oh, you're going to tease me like that, are you? There's actually an Ascendant crossbow in here. I don't know if it's any good. There's also a Storm Terror Bird over there, which I'm trying to not anger. Still going to stop and grab it. Wasn't as good as the one that I've got, but still. Uh, some pretty cool loot out of the few drops that I just decided to pick up. I'll, uh, I'll show you guys in just a second. Uh, lots of Ascendant stuff. It's actually insane how good these things have been lately. Uh, but unfortunately, no charcoal. So we are going to have to find uh, another way to get our hands on that. Basically, what we are doing is powering up this crossbow as good as we can get. It's our only means of torpor. Uh, hey, maybe there are some dinosaurs I could tame for torpor purposes. But if there are, I don't know what they are just yet. Um, let me just transfer all of that. And then quickly grab it back. We'll open up our little salvage station, which is already full of crazy stuff, actually. Holy moly, look at that. I'll take that hatchet any day of the week. Um, man, I really got to start paying attention because I've just been busting up everything. And there's some actually really good stuff here that I probably shouldn't be doing that with. Like these leggings. What is that? All the saddles, scuba gear, that stuff. I do not care about any of that. Um, but as for the other stuff, yeah, we got we to hold on to that. Even the crossbow, scuba, saddle, um, that... Oh, compound bow. I might actually hold on to. Just because why not? Get all the metal structures in there. Bam. All right, that'll do it. Let's just salvage all of that. Now that, that is some resources. Resources I might actually be able to put to some use. We got thousands of metal now too. A little bit of obsidian. Could do with a little bit more of that. Charcoal. Can I bust that up? I can't bust that up. I thought maybe I can grind that down to charcoal. Um... But no, unfortunately not. All right, anyways, that's good. That really sort of sets us up pretty good. Um, let me go get some of these guys out of my face. My goodness. And then quickly just distribute this. So here's what I'm thinking. I don't know if I can afford it just yet. But if I can get my hands on a forge. Uh, I was thinking one of these. I'm not level 80 yet, am I? I'm so close though. Oh, four more levels and we could get us an industrial forge. Also, what in the world is that thing? Um, but now, though, I guess instead, all we can do is pull some wood into here. Let that smelt up uh, or burn down or whatever it is that it does. Is there any other way I can, I can fry this stuff up really quick? Can't put it in here. That's unfortunate. It's either this or campfires then, I think. Um, but yeah, if I'm patient enough to wait for that to burn down, then, uh, we should be able to get this crossbow just that little bit further along. Here's the thing though. That's only half the job. The other half of the job is we need to collect some apex blood. That's going to get us more narcotics, more arrows, and then we can get this Rex. So what I'm thinking about is maybe we go tracking down some apex well just big apex creatures basically we got a few brontos nearby these guys actually sometimes have a truckload of health yeah i'm not gonna be able to kill that one just yet actually yeah all these guys are really high level never mind that there is this one but probably not gonna work uh an apex diplo could work we got a few out here a level 60 level 180 perhaps you know it could be worth a check all right, so turns out the magic biome up here is actually, uh, oh, Swordmaster, how you doing, mate? <laughs> oh, I'm not happy to see you again. Uh, but this place actually has some really low level Apex Diplos in it. So I'm going to try and pay them a visit without hopefully getting 
attacked by a sword master up there. Um, these guys... Oh, still got a lot of health, though. But we should be able... Yeah, I'm seeing those trees fall. Kind of terrifying. We should be able to get us, hopefully, a nice amount of hide off of these guys. It might take a little while. Looks like they can't take headshots, unfortunately. That's a shame. But um, it should pay off. It should pay off. It should pay off as long as I don't end up dying out here too. Big old sword master up there. Hey, 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 hey. That's my meat. That's my meat and blood or whatever it is that I'm actually trying to collect out of this guy. Oh, you stinking raptor. Uh, what did that get us though? 87. Not bad, not bad. That's a few narcotics and arrows just there alone. On to the next. Like I said, these guys are all pretty low level, thankfully. So, works out an absolute treat. Um, dang it. I'm really hoping that one of these has some charcoal in it. It'd save me a little bit of time, but it is what it is. All right. Let's get to it again. Best part is though, it's pretty much a... I would say a no downside kill. Aside from losing a little bit of time, they can't hurt us. They can't kill us. They just knock us back a little bit. So no danger involved. We just got to do what we got to do. All right, this time around. Well, actually, I think it actually worked out to be exactly the same. <laughs> I don't think the Raptor earlier actually ended up like taking any of it from us. Um, anyways, we got like 200 blood now, so that's nice. And all of the hide we're getting from this is actually going to go in handy for some saddles later too. The other actually thing I should have checked out though is Apex Parasaurathiums. I don't know why I didn't check these guys out. Unfortunately, none of them nearby, but there is a pretty low level one over there. They could actually be very, 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 like, very good for us, I suppose. They could drop a lot of, uh, a lot of hide and blood for us, but... We'll just stick to the diplos for now. All right, this one I do want to do a little bit differently, though. I don't... Can you stop? I don't want to... You know what? Oh, one more hit. I'm trying. I don't want to harvest it with my guy. I want to use my new hatchet. Oh, double whammy. That's nice. Okay, sweet. So we got double the resources out of that. So, you know what? That's probably good. We've probably got enough now. Uh, let's head back to base. I think we might be okay. That leaves us... With a total of 400 blood. Dude, that is probably the most Apex blood we've had yet. So, let's see what sort of narcotics I can pull from this. We've got plenty of actual narcotics. We could probably get, like, how much is it per per one? Six. That's 50. So, that's it's only going to get us about 30 extra arrows. But better than nothing, it might actually put us over the edge. Bring them over here. Where I've already got a stack of 20. And we'll craft up 43 arrows? Yeah. 43 arrows. Maybe I gotta get some more arrows going too, though. Alrighty. Get them in there. Can I get any more? Or is that just the perfect amount? It was just the perfect amount. 73 arrows. Okay. Um, we've only got 27 extra charcoal, unfortunately. Not the end of the world. It is what it is. But we can put that in there. We might be able to get a few more of these. How many? One! because oh, it's 25 per wow okay not not the great not the best but 692 percent that's a big improvement is it enough i couldn't tell you but uh it's time for us to now go and repay a visit to the alpha rex the level 500 unless there is a better one which there is not so uh yeah time for us to begin the flight out there and hopefully i don't know <laughs> Hopefully. Oh. oh, Apex. Oh, wow. Level 577. No, thank you very much. Yeah. Let's go see if we can tame this Rex. Now, just a little reminder. Yesterday when we were out here, there was a demonic wyvern flying around. A big old boy. Big chonky fella. So I'm, I'm looking to avoid that at all costs. I do not want to be messing with that. Um, we're also kind of in a crash zone. I've crashed out here a few times. I don't want to crash out here again. So fingers crossed that doesn't happen. I also don't have enough kibble, I just realized. But that's fine. Uh, for now, let me get this guy's attention. I don't want to get bitten by the thing because I don't know what sort of damage that is going to deal to us. But I do need his attention. So what is that? Bionic Megatherium. That could be problematic. It's got a million health too. Also a bunch of things that have... Died down here, I think. 
No. Hello, Parasorathium. Dude, this actually could come in handy. This little ruin over here. All right. Let's have a little look. If I can get a hit on him, should get his attention. Okay, I cannot afford to be wasting arrows. So we do need to be a little careful. That's another miss. What is wrong with me? Oh my goodness. Okay, okay. Please. That's just a little bit of a safer spot. Not from a safety point of view, just from a hitting this done. I just missed again. All right. I've just missed four shots. That's four arrows we ain't getting back. I can barely afford these things as is. What is wrong with me? All right, at least we're safe down here. I can't hit a target today. What is going on? What is going on? Oh, that is just disgusting. All right, not the time. Not the time, little dragonfly. We've got a big fella over here too. Just great. All right, at least it wasn't the big fella that came to attack me. But he's probably going to. All right. I just got dismounted. Oh, you're kidding me. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, Teratodon. No. No. He's raw dismounted me. I forgot that was even a, 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 a thing. Can he get up here? I have no clue. But I hope that he thinks he can. Because if he thinks he can, I mean, he's going to try. I need to be so careful here. Can you get wedged in that spot again, please, mate? I, dude, I have lost about 50,000 potential torpor. Missing this guy. Oh, dude, he is like, he could pro, oh my goodness. Yeah, so each arrow seems to be dealing about 10,000. <laughs> uh, we've missed a lot of them, unfortunately. What an absolute travesty. Our double jump ability might actually be good for us here. I just gotta be careful of what else is out here. You know what I do need to do? Set a little remote teleport. So I can come and go as I please. But dude, my poor Tyranodon. We ain't getting that back. That is a that is a shame. That is a big old shame. The good news is though, we definitely have enough arrows to tame this guy, or at least knock him out. So we got that going for us. That's it. Roar all you like, mate. Not gonna do you any good. going to give me a nice easy target to hit and I can hopefully hide from you dude you can hit me right I don't know but he's like dude this ruin is like perfectly positioned for me we've got him nearly halfway there that was a terrible shot if I die here I don't know how <laughs> I'm kidding well I can get back we're probably just going to die a few times in the process. So let's, let's just, just, just try and avoid that as a possibility. Or it's just not, it's unnecessary. Um, hey, buddy. Oh, that's a terrible shot. Dude, I went and collected all that blood. I'm mean, just throwing these arrows away like they're nothing. Terrible, terrible, terrible. I'm so dead. I do not know how I'm not dead. Go, 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 go. Oh my goodness. All right, is he gonna? Oh, I'm gonna just miss another shot. Because I'm just the worst marksman in the world today, apparently. Can you not go that direction? I don't think it's safe over there for either of us. Please. I don't need you getting hit by anything else. Just, just go to sleep. Dude, there are so many dead bodies out here. Is it Caprasuchus? Got him, got him, got him. No! <laughs> that was an apex too. Are you joking? <laughs> All right, look, we got the Rex down. That's the main thing. I don't think anything out there is a predator of it, so it should be safe for now. Oh, I just gonna. I need. To, I need to get back out there and not die now. That's the problem. Um, you know what? It could be time for us to do. Should have done this a long time ago. I'm just gonna do it now. Let me get myself a gravestone. Um, I'm going to need my Alpha Raptor for a bit of help. Or my Kano, actually. It's going to drop this here. I should be able to grab my stuff. Nice. <laughs> Let's go. That's one way to do it. Better than nothing. 
Uh, how's our Kano coming along? Very wrecked. Need some health potions. Um, and the other thing that I need urgently is some kibble. Need like two pieces of it, I think. No, we actually got enough. We got six. Oh, hell yeah. All right, nice. Nice. Okay. Um, I'm going to drop my raptor. He's going to be my little safety beacon. And then we're going to head back. And hopefully not die. That part can't be guaranteed. We're going to try our best here, though. All right. Where's old... Where's the old Capris Suchus? Oh. Let me get my guy's dead body. Gonna need that at some point. Capri ain't got a lot of health. But he could probably spear tackle me off my raptor. Now that I think about it too. So we don't want that. No, we do not. My Rex looks pretty safe out there. So that's good. Uh, what's that? Baryonyx? That's fine. It's only got 4,000 health. I think we're safe. I'm going to go for it. Get it all in. And he wants five kibble. And then... Dude, there's a nature dialogue over there too. And a bionic. I don't know how neither of us took damage or died there, but... <laughs> Wow. Okay, I don't know. Was that the Bionic Megatherium? I have no idea. Uh, all I know is I got my prize and I'm taking it home and I'm feeling pretty darn good about it right this second. Let's go. All right. What a relief. <laughs> that could have gone so darn bad. Um, yeah, I ain't wasting any time. We can saddle this thing up right this second. Show Alpha Rex saddle. Uh, what am I doing? It's over here. Please tell me I've got what we need. Yeah. We do. We do. I might even be able to upgrade this thing. Which probably would be a good call. Um, and then we'll, we'll suss out the stats on this guy in just a second. There's my saddle. Um, and honestly... Hey, this is the salvage station. I'm honestly tempted to upgrade this just to get my guy here a little bit of extra armor. But here we are. <laughs> yes. Can you roar? I know you can roar. You roared at me. Doesn't want to roar today, though, unfortunately. All right, fine. Whatever. What are your stats looking like, though? Let's have a look. My guy here has 146,000 health. Uh, I don't know what sort of damage he deals. But let's take him for a little walk across the pond. And we'll go and bite something to find out. Hopefully. I think there are a few little... But well, there were a bunch of dodos over here a little earlier. Uh, they all seem to have died. So that's not good. Um, Lystrosaurus. See, that's what I'm worried about. <laughs> that's what I'm worried about. As far as traits go, he's tenacious. Uh, gains incoming damage reduction as health falls. So as he is lower health, he gets extra protection. That's pretty cool. Um, it's not really going to help us against a lot of these guys since they're all going to one-shot us. But it's better than nothing. Could be worse. What is going on over there? Either way, it's, hey, you. 2,000 damage from a Pteranodon. Why did I get a little Explorer note thing from that? That's interesting. Um, yeah, this place ain't safe. Ain't safe one bit. Where can I take you that might be... You know what? Nah, that's a terrible idea. Let's go to the... Uh... Uh... <laughs> I don't want to take him back out to the swamp, but I mean, the swamp was kind of chill. So maybe that's, maybe that could work. Uh, we'll find out pretty soon. As long as we don't run into whatever that bionic creature was that was just dropping big bombs. All right. Sorry, Fiomia. Just an easy target and you're sitting right there. Uh, I think it was the Megatherium. Don't know what triggered him. This feels so sketchy though. I don't like, I don't trust this one bit. There's also a Hydro Spino. Not good. My guy received 7,000 health per level. Oh my goodness. Oh, we can't underplay that. That's, that is, that is good. That's a lot of health. Like, that's the difference between life and death. Um, is that an Apex Fiomia? What? Hello. 
Oh my goodness. Not to mention the knockback. 7,500 damage on a headshot too. Let's go. Woohoo. Nice. Oh, that's good. Oh, that's good. That's some solid damage too. 2,500 on a regular hit. 7,500 on a headshot. Um, let's get that damage up a little higher. And seriously, I'm kind of kind of tempted to take it to the Hydro Spino. It's going to be bad. We'll probably die. Which is why I'm not doing that. But still, a few levels on my guy here. You might have what it takes. Anyways, this area seems pretty juice. So I'm going to take advantage of that. We're just going to cruise on over here. These are all apexes and alphas at the worst. So let's kill some Spinos. Just not the Hydro one yet. Might get to him later. We'll see. Oh, he's got that water reduction thing. Yeah. Okay. 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 So we do need to be a little careful still. Um, can Sarkos and Capros dismount me? I have no clue, actually. Um, hey. Hey. You're being a little mean and aggressive there, champ. Sarko, you're next, mate. Oh, you're at Apex. No wonder. No, you're not doing your death roll on me, mate. Not today. Not today. I really got to watch my back, too. <laughs> Come on. This guy's actually got a lot of health. Okay, so this is how the Spino fight would look. Wouldn't look good. Wouldn't look good at all. But we got a few good kills there. Fantastic. 23 levels up our sleeve too. Um, yeah, let's 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 crank that up. It's looking good. I like what I'm seeing. I need. I now need to go and see exactly what that means for our damage dealing. Oh, hello. Three and a half thousand. Not bad. Not bad. What do we got over here? I'm trying to like look in the distance because I don't want to go there until I'm sure I can kill it all. Apex Akatina. Alpha. Apex Dimorphodon. Apex Baryonyx. I could kill all of this stuff. Unless like a Broodmother spawns in. There's a supply drop over there with a Mammoth Saddle and some bullets in it. That's actually decent. Hydro Sarko. That's kind of concerning though. Yeah, I don't know if I got what it takes to take on a Hydro Sarko. Also, something else that might bite us in the booty at some point. My guy here is very slow. Very slow. Like, way too slow to... It, uh, yeah, it's concerningly slow. It, might, it may be an issue as time goes on. Right now, though, it doesn't seem too threatening. Like, we're not... You know what? If I'm going to die, we're going to die. I'm not going to be able to outrun it anyway. So maybe it doesn't matter. Oh, something just something just dropped. Oh, some special skin. I got a cosmetic there. What was it? I don't know how this new cosmetic system works. But I, I, I definitely got something there. Anyways. Oh, no, it's on the floor. No, did I pick it up? I don't know. There was something going on. All right. As our experience look at now, nah, we only got one extra level. That's not worth looking at just yet. Alf Apex Beezer Bufo. Hey, Froggy. Seriously, you could actually be a worthwhile team. But not going to wait around to find out. You're just going to die. And there's that Hydro Sark. No, what is that? That is the Hydro Sark. I don't, I don't trust that. I don't like the look of that. That concerns me, especially since I've seen what that Storm Allosaurus did to a Giga, and that thing dealt like 50,000 damage with a single hit. So, yeah, if that's the type of damage we're looking at, we're going to die pretty quick. And I don't feel like losing my Rex just yet. No, thank you very much. All right. What is that? Colossus Hydro Sarko? <laughs> you know, it's actually... Hold on, there's an Alpha Parasaurathium, and then, yeah, literally a Colossus Hydro Sarko in there. I don't actually know. Like, I, I, I feel like I could take it on. It's not the end of the world. Also, my inventory is very heavy. Is that why I'm moving around so slowly at the moment? It might be. Oh, look how much faster. Uh, it's about the same. Anyways, um, that Sarko is dying to something. It's suffocating. Wait, what? It's, its ability is meant to suffocate other things. Did it suffocate itself? 
Oh, what a shame. What a missed opportunity. Yeah, dude, the hydro... So the hydro dinosaurs are meant to be able to suffocate their targets. That's their whole thing. And this, he just... I think he just offed himself trying to fight a snake. Hydro Beasel Buffo. That thing will probably kill me there. Dang it. Oh, that's actually a shame. That would have been... That would have been an easy kill. Would have got some nice resources out of it. Wasn't meant to be. Wasn't meant to be. Why am I even going in this direction? Oh, yep. Yeah, that just confirms my suspicions. Let's go somewhere else. <laughs> when you see a bionic explosion, it is time to go. All right, out here by my desert edge village. I don't know if there's actually any dinosaurs that spawn out here, but I felt like it could be a nice little spot to check out. Um, unfortunately, they pretty barren. Not a lot going on out here. Apex Parasaur, a pair of them. Hey guys. Um, sorry. <laughs> sorry. It's kind of sorry, not sorry though. Know what I mean? Dude, this is actually, this is actually amazing base potential over here. Like, it's flat, it's green. You kind of got this whole area to the side here. There's not a lot of dinosaurs. That can change. And it has changed in the past, but it still looks pretty friendly. I'm going to keep this one in mind. I actually kind of like this spot. Hmm, as much as I'm having a lot of fun just wrecking everything in our path, I don't know if an Apex Bronto is a good call. <laughs> Especially not with this big Earth Bronto, like, sitting right next to him. I am going to avoid that uh, for now. My guy's still only dealing about 3,000 damage, which isn't a game changer by any means, but it's it's, it's in the right direction. Um, he's just going to need a little bit of help getting further along, I suppose. So a bit of leveling. And uh, he's, he's not far from having some potential. Maybe what he really needs is an imprint. So maybe, well, actually it's a she. So maybe we're going to find a male alpha, breed them together, and then like, level up the baby maybe that's where the potential really lies but definitely 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 an improvement on anything we've had so far oh snap yeah i'm out i'm out no thanks don't feel like dealing with a frost wyvern right this second <laughs> i didn't even see him there oh my goodness he was like just disguised in the mist but uh let's go we've done it we've done it i like it Guys, gonna end this one here. Thanks for watching. Rip to the Pteranodon, but welcome to the Rex. Gonna need a new flyer. So I gotta keep my eyes peeled for that and see what I can find. But uh, yeah, guys, I'll catch you in the next one very soon. Until then, keep smiling. Have a fantastic day. Bye for now.